Hey everybody, AmpRepairGuy.com, 203-892-4119. Here we have my military tube tester. It's a TV-7 slash U. I use it to test 572P tubes that come in with customers' amplifiers that are in for repair. It allows me to test for mutual conductance, which tells me the emission level of a tube. And if the tubes out of an amplifier are matched or not. You know, when you have a matched set of tubes, you want them to test pretty close to each other, if not the same. So this tester allows that. And then I also test the tube on my high pot tester. So I'll use the high pot tester, which is a DC high pot tester, to go between the plate, the filament, and then the filament and the grid which tells me if the tube's safe to plug into an amplifier. So these two tubes, this one and this one came out of a, oops, no, this and this came out of a Heathkit SB200. They've had a lot of use, so they're at the end of their life. Um, so I'm going to show, I'm going to do the test and turn it on. Let's see. Good used tube will test, you know, 30, you know, thir mid 30s, 36, 35, or greater. So, this tube shot. And as you can see, only one side of the filament is lighting. It's kind of hard to see with the camera, but I'll go ahead and carefully pull it out so I don't damage the socket. And here's the second one. Put it in. Also dead. Pull this out. This clips are tight. And this is another one. This is a another used tube. But I'll just go to show. I'll just show you here. So it's like 39. It's not not new, but it's still usable. So that's how I test tubes that come in with a customer's amplifier, at least the mutual conductance test. Thanks for watching. The website's amprepairguy.com, 203-892-4119. And I have three amplifiers apart, waiting on parts, 3001 Collins. This one will be for sale soon. I'm waiting on a band switch. It's a cubic, pretty clean, 1500ZA. And there's the SB200 and a Ameritron AL811H. I have more upstairs and on the way. So, thank, for, thank you for watching. AmpRepairGuy.com, 203-892-4119. Take care.